longtime NFL linebacker Alec Ogletree, who spent a portion of the 2020 season with the New York Jets, has decided to call it a career. And just like that it's a wrap, Ogletree began in an Instagram post. Thank you at NFL at Rams at Nijians at Nijets at Chicago Bears for allowing me to play nine unforgettable years in the league. Thank you to all my teammates that I got a chance to play with and know over the years. The former linebacker continued. Thank you to my wife at Alex Ogletree 03.14 for being there to support, pick me up, help, correct? Whatever the case may be, lol there are many things I could say about you and how blessed I am to have you in my life but I appreciate your love for me and our family. Thank you to my parents for pushing me to be all I can be and supporting me through it all exclamation mark most of all I want thank God Almighty, Jesus, the Holy Spirit for being with me every step of the way. If you know me then you know me and if you don't know me I hope one day we get a chance to know each other a little bit better. The announcement concluded. I love y'all and thank you again for supporting me over the years. Alec Hugletree was former first round pick with Rams, spent time with Giants. Jet Spares The St. Louis Rams selected Ogletree with the 30th overall pick in 2013. He had his best moments with his first organization, splitting time between St. Louis and Los Angeles after the franchise changed locations. Over those five seasons, Ogletree logged 503 total tackles, 31 for a loss, with 5.5 sacks, 12 forced fumbles, 6 interceptions, 43 passes defended and 2 touchdowns. He was also voted a team captain with the Rams, starting 67 games. From there, Ogletree went to the crosstown rival New York Giants for two years, racking up another 173 total tackles, 10 for a loss, over 26 starts. He added two more sacks with Big Blue, as well as six more interceptions, 14 more passes defended and two more touchdowns. As is the case with most linebackers, Ogletree's body started to break down on him as his career went along. He latched on with the Jets in 2020 after an injury to starter Avery Williamson. But he didn't appear to have much left in the tank, registering three tackles for a loss over two appearances. After being released by the Jets, Ogletree ended his career with the Chicago Bears in 2021 and was able to finish on a high note, starting 16 games for the first time since 2016. He did not suit up in 2022 and now it appears he's decided to close the door on an NFL return. Jets could deploy four-man pound unit in 2023. The Jets surprised some when they opened the season with four linebackers in 2022. Those players were C.J. Mosley, Quincy Williams, Quan Alexander, and Jamie Sherwood. It could be a similar look in 2023, except substitute Alexander for rookie sixth-rounders Ayer Barnes. Of course, Alexander could still resign late in free agency or the Jets could decide to keep an extra body with special teams ability, like one of their new advice, Caleb Johnson, Claude and Cherylis, Malik Hall, or former 2021 draft pick Homsen Azrilveen, who was initially cut a year ago, returning on the practice squad. Having said that, it could very well just be the four pounds considering the Jets' defense under head coach Robert Soleil. And defensive coordinator Jeff Elbrick plays some variation of nickel formation a majority of the time. Sherwood has already received a vote of confidence as the potential Alexander replacement at Sam, strong side linebacker, while also learning the Mike, middle pound, responsibilities behind Mosley. That leaves Barnes as the likely fourth man, a developmental prospect and special teamer that can also spell Williams at will, weak side pound. What they've gotten in Barnes, 6 to 1, 227, is a jack of all trades and a master of many, team reporter Randy Link scouted in April. For starters, he played safety in Illinois High School and when he started out his college carer at WMU before shifting to pound, a transition that Jets head coach Robert Saleh and defensive coordinator Jeff Elbrick are known to favor.